My name is Ispana Rajiji. I'm going to conduct your IELTS interview. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Can I start? Yes. Do you understand me? Yes, I can. Introduce yourself fully. Okay. My name is Anmol Charit and I'm from Faria City. Faria City is located in the district Mandiwa housing that is the present in the north of the Punjab. Are you a student of Bhakha? I'm a student and I'm doing IELTS. What is your last qualification? Uh, my last qualification is a BS, <coughs> BS honor and I have done my graduations with the specialization of chemistry in the field of analytical chemistry. Okay. Mm -hmm. Have you ever seen some old building in your city? Uh, yes, there are some old building in my city that is Pija Puksha Stadium and other some monuments that are located and indicate some memories of the ancient people. Do you think we should prepare for building in the cities? Uh, definitely, I think it is too much necessary for the uh, status of the city and uh, for the popularity of this place. Okay. Do you prefer living in the old building or in the modern building? Um, according to the pace of the time, I prefer to live with them in the new building because new building provides some different opportunities and uh, some other availabilities to us. Okay. Are there any old building you want to see in the future? Uh, yes, I want to see some buildings in the Islamabad like uh, uh, monuments that have a lot of memories about the some old people that had worked for the popularity and the progress of the city. Okay. Here I am going to give you a topic. You okay. need to speak for one to two minutes. Okay. Before it, you will have one minute. If you wish, you can make note. Okay. Discover a website which helps you to do something, a website you visited often or uh, you use regularly. Here you have your topic. You have your one minute. If you wish, you can make note. Here you have your page and pencil. Okay. So, I had tell you already that I am a student and I had a lot of work to do online so i like to talk about a website that i have used daily in, uh, in life for the presentations for the study and uh, some other activities so that is quora uh, actually quora is a uh, app and uh, uh, on the other side is a website that provides a lot of information about the study field educational uh, research but the most favorite thing is that uh, a lot of people and uh, different uh, philosophers and researchers shares a lot of uh, their data in the form of blogs. So I read these blogs and uh, collect some uh, collect some anal analytical data in the form of qualitative or the quantitative analysis. These help uh, these uh, websites help me a lot because uh, uh, if I talk about my life experience in the university life. I have uh, I had some uh, tasks like uh, presentations and on the other field I have to do work in the laboratories to make some things new like uh, some products in the chemistry okay. field. Okay. So I use. Okay. Okay. Who in your family use this site? Uh, actually, my father use uh, use this website, so he pre he preferred me to use this and. Uh, uh, gain a lot of opportunities from this. Can internet help children in their study? Mm, according to my thought, uh, internet has uh, some effects on the study. They may be uh, they may be effective and they may be adverse. But if the students are defined by their parents, so they can use by the effective method. Will the internet replace teacher in the future? Um, Maybe, but uh, according to my thought, it is not possible because pe teachers are the person who teach a lot of things by face to face or by manual method. So we, uh, in in all fields of life, we need a teacher just to learn. And what are the reasons why people use the internet? Uh, actually, study, business, and other jobs are converted online uh, are changed into online sites. So people use a lot of internet in this time. What kind of people don't use internet? Mm. Some people who do not know about the internet, um, for example, our ancestors, 
which do not have any experience or observations about the about the uh, developments or the other researchers. Thank you very much for your interview, Governor. Thank you.